All right, people. I believe everybody is doing great, nice and absolutely fine. Listen to me very, very, very carefully. Sir, I am getting 300 marks, but I don't know how am I supposed to pull these and so that I can reach, we say, 650 over here, okay? So I have to boost my marks from 300 to 650 or I have to boost my marks from 400 to 650. This was the question which every single time I used to get from the students when I was in offline, okay? And right now also people contact me and they ask me the same particular question over here, okay? So and, and, when it comes to the experience of the educators, we know how we can take you from these 300 and we'll get you the 650 marks in the need and that too in a very small amount of time. There are some strategies, some points that we will be discussing in this particular video. So this is very important. Do share this video with all the friends out there, okay? We keep on coming up with the academic content every single time, the different, different series. But these strategy videos are also important so that you can reach your goal. You can enter the medical college in the upcoming time. Now, listen to me very carefully. We say in 45 days, you have to basically go from 300 to 650. I'll not tell you if you are at zero, then you will go to the 650 in 45 days. No, I'm saying if you are stuck at 400, you are stuck at 300, you are stuck at 500, you have to go to 650. This video is definitely for you, for the need 2024 aspirants. Now, before that, let me just tell you, we are coming up with an amazing surprise. Amazing surprise. What is that? That is an Academy Learning Festival. Before starting the strategy, these are this is something which I wanted to share with you personally. Sir, what is this an Academy Learning Festival? See, for the complete seven days, one complete week, an Academy is giving you the access to all, you can access all the batches which are inside an Academy, be it pay, paid batches, free batches, whatever it is. You can access the notes, every single thing, okay? Now, let me just tell you what are the features that you can get in this batch. We say we'll be getting access to all the batches which are running inside the platform. Be it need batches, be it JE batches. And you can access, access you will have the access to chapter wise notes. You can download all, all these notes in these seven days, okay? Completely free of cost. And what is the third thing that you'll be getting over here? You can access the test series also. You want to download the papers, different papers which top educators have made. You can basically do that. And the next thing that I want to tell you over here is you can access the chapter wise mocks. Okay. Now, how can you do it? The link is in the description below. Click on to that link. You'll reach on to an academy's page. Okay. And you'll be getting access of all of these over there. You'll have to log in. It'll ask for the code. You can use my code. Yawar. You don't have to pay anything completely free of cost. Okay. Now listen to me very carefully. So there are two categories of students. The first category I say over here, those, uh, that category, which have just completed their syllabus. Okay. We'll talk about these people, what they are supposed to do for the next 45 days so that they'll get the 650 plus. And then we'll talk about who are yet to complete their syllabus means they have so incomplete syllabus as of now, okay? We'll be talking about both the categories. Let's talk about the type one category of students over here. Listen to me very carefully. If we have got 45 days left over here, if we have got 45 days left, we say, we say, what you are supposed to do if your syllabus is completed, we say full syllabus revisions you are supposed to do. How many revisions? We say, sir, five revisions minimum you guys have to do because when it comes to cracking the need, revision plays a very important role. That's why we say five full syllabus mock tests, five full syllabus revisions you guys are supposed to do over here. Next, next, we'll have to go with the NCRT reading. We'll have to read NCRT when it comes to, guys, guys, even at the end point of time, even be it the revisions or be it the regular uh, learning, we say NCRT reading is every at every single point, NCRT reading reading is must okay and you have to make the notes what notes we say revision notes first is the uh, regular lecture notes second is the revision notes because these revision notes will also help you in getting the selection okay what is the first thing five full syllabus revisions what is the second thing ncrt revisions what is the third thing you will have to make the notes while you are doing this and most importantly my dear friends during these revisions you will have to basically do the NCRT in-text questions, okay? 
be it we say uh, exercise or be it we say solved examples from the NCRT, this is what you are supposed to do. In five full syllabus mock tests, in five full syllabus revisions, these are the things what you are supposed to do. NCRT reading, it should be there. We say notes, self-made, it should be there. We say NCRT index questions and exercise, you have to solve these. And most importantly, we say previous year questions. We, that is very, very important because every single time we keep on telling you PYQs, PYQs, PYQs. Now, my dear friends, comes basically the mock test. How many mock tests are you, you guys are supposed to do? We said 25 minimum mock tests you are supposed to give in these days, okay? In 45 days, okay? That is, we say alternate days you are supposed to give the mock test because mock tests help you to analyze and understand the exam pattern. The mock test should be completely like you are sitting inside the NEET exam, okay? So, uh, once you give the mock test at, at the end of the, the uh, day, uh, you guys are supposed to analyze the results. Sir, I'm lagging in this portion. Why did I lag? I'll have to repeat. I'll have to put solo more questions on this particular pattern. Now, now, now the type two students, okay? So those students whose syllabus is incomplete as of now, what they are supposed to do is, we say, we say, first 15 days, you guys have to complete all those high weightage chapters, which are having the highest weightage in the entire syllabus, okay? If, if you can complete 20 high weightage chapters over here, I request you to do that as soon as possible for these first 15 days, okay? Now, you'll say, sir, how can I complete these 15 high weightage chapters? We say, we have the game of need available on YouTube. Game of Neat Marathon series on this particular channel. I have taught, Vaseem sir has taught, HSP sir has taught, Ambika ma'am has taught. We say all those chapters are available over there. You can complete those chapters within seconds. Or second thing is, we have the Neat Last Lap series that is going on right now. You can basically join that also on this channel only three of course. You can complete those chapters, okay? Next is, we say NCRT reading has to be there, okay? While you are studying these chapters and NCRT in-text questions and exercise questions. Why do I keep on saying this again and again? You have to do these things because these are the things only which matter. These are the things only which will get you the score 650 plus, okay? No other thing. I do, I'll not say you uh, go on to that reference book, take that reference book and follow the questions and uh, do, uh, do the theory of that at this end point of time. No, we say no. So you have to go with these things, okay? And most importantly, previous year questions. Now, after that, sir, how many revisions for me, for this category too? We say, we say at least three revisions for you guys, okay? We say minimum three revisions you have to do. For the complete syllabus students, we say five revisions. For you, it should be three minimum revisions. Then we say 15 mock tests minimum you guys are supposed to give full syllabus 15 mock tests, okay? Then only you'll be able to get that feeling uh, like I am now able to sit the, in the examination hall and I'll crack it, okay? Now, my dear friends, we have over here, what are the mistakes that you guys need to avoid at this point of time while preparing for these 45 days? What is the first thing? We say, do not try anything new. You don't have to try, like I'll go with that books, I'll go with this reference book, okay? Like the detailed videos, don't, don't waste your time on references, detailed videos, no. You have to stick to whatever we say at this point of time, because we know we have the experience, okay? Like now all those points which I have covered about, you have to focus on those only. And, and most importantly, don't go through two, three new question banks, you will say, I'll follow this question bank, that question bank, no. At this point of time, the NCRT questions, NCRT previous year, quest previous year questions, NCRT in-text and solved exercise, and the teacher's questions, teacher's notes, that's it. That is the sufficient for you guys. I hope this was all about it, okay? This was completely the video based on the analysis and all. Uh, so thank you so much. I hope, uh, do let me know in the comments how was the video and do share it with your friends and all. And do join this Unacademy Learning Festival, which is completely free of cost. Link is in the description below. Thank you so much.